With all the financial uncertainty in our state, a local representative and senator are hoping to shed some light through a series of town hall meetings. Pension reform, education funding, and special needs budget cuts were on the minds of those in attendance at the first town hall meeting hosted by State Representative Grant Worley and State Senator Michael Conley. A lot of times the only thing people uh, hear from Springfield are, you know, we'll send out our newsletters, we'll send out our emails, and then they'll read in the paper. Uh, but I think it's important that they get to hear from Grant and I that uh, we are doing a lot of things down there and uh, we are working with everybody, uh, both sides of the aisle, to, to make Illinois you know, stronger. I think it's important that they hear that. More than 130 people filled the seats in council chambers for the event. Worley and Connolly agree with Rauner's overall plan that budget reform needs to come before revenue, something that doesn't sit well with many residents. Well, they said they don't like that where we're, we're at, but they're also saying reform has to come first before revenue comes. And, you know, I've been around for a really long time and I don't see reform happening. And if we got to wait for reform to happen, our people are not going to get serviced. The open question forum made residents feel their concerns were taken seriously and um, helped them gain a better understanding others. of the governor's and plans. I think a lot of people got to express their concerns and I think I'm the already. senator and the representative did a nice job of um, expressing their position and um, really they weren't um, apologists for the governor. Um, in places where they kind of aligned with him, they said they aligned. In other places they didn't align, they said, well, I'm not the governor. Because of the high turnout, Connolly and Worley plan to host more of these meetings all over their districts. So that it's more intimate and, uh, you know, take a couple of hours of time. I mean, that's our job is to make ourselves available to the people. To find out when the next meeting is near you, go to either the representatives or senators' websites.